and welcome to my Elder Scrolls stream. Jump right back into it. Sorry. We'll go back to tonight. Um, might have to hop off without warning partway through. Hopefully, I'll let you get the chance to let you know. But I sh believe I should be okay. Walker, have you come seeking work? There is much to do here in elsewhere. Ma, all manner of work, Rook. Miss Susie offers tasks that you can fix. Don't forget oh. to check back regularly. For the daily jobs, which I do not care about. It's not right now. And I was just there.
You've arrived. I sense there's a great deal to uncover here. Hmm. Some kind of Kajiti children's tale? You know better than that, Witch of Azura. Greetings, spirit. We've come in good faith. Very well. Who is this youth who travels with you, I wonder? Come, child. Let all the Maz Amiri have a look at you. Trespass or a pilgrim? <laughs> Both, I think. But you walk this path aimlessly, child. I am Mazamiri, clan mother of the Hidden Moon. Why are you here? <laughs> Too late for that. Our wards flicker and fade. My children all lie dead. No one and nothing remains to stop Arunkal. We failed. I failed. Even if a champion emerged to wield the Moonlight Blade, the Azura's Sword of the Faithful. Oof, you know nothing of our ways, child. Even so, I see strength. How would you know what to ask? You know nothing. Just read the stone. So, the adepts acted as soul shepherds? Ushering true souls to paradise and bent souls to this great darkness. Hmm, quite a task. So, the adepts charged themselves with defending the liminal border between this world and oblivion, the lunar lattice, as they saw it. Gatekeepers of the sword. Intriguing. I see. The Hidden Moon Adepts practice the form of necromancy here, pressing the souls of their corrupted kin into service so that Come they might now, be Wanderer, redeemed. If you're not afraid. Do you see now, child? We servants of the Hidden Moon protected and guided the people's souls. Azura's twilight path. The path to love and redemption is fraught with perils and temptations. I thought I prepared our adepts to face the dark. Ah, how easy you make it sound. teaching stone can tell. Arum Kaul served our order for many years as our greatest champion. But as his power grew, so did his pride. In time, he renounced his faith in Azura and turned to the dark path. The way of the Tropa. Many adepts fell under his sway, and the order collapsed into civil. The battle sundered the temple and blighted the canyon below. Triumphed in the end, but Aruko would not die. He fled, seeking refuge in one of his orbs. We locked the orbs away, but now our wards grow brittle, and Aruko prepares to emerge once again. Only a warrior of the Hidden Moon can end this. And only with the powers of the Moonlight Blade. Make no mistake, child. Arum calls power and hatred have only grown since we first locked him away. The remnants of our order spent their waning years looking for a way to... It is more than a blade. It is a gateway. A path. A key. Only a handful of adepts have ever held the Moonlight Blade, and each of them possessed a wheel of iron. I need to know... <laughs> I would worry if... <laughs> only the very crude would call it necromancy. Yes, we reanimated the skeletons of fallen Khajiit, but always as a path to redemption. 
by fighting for their true spirited kin. Victory illuminated the soul and loosened Namira's hold on them. When the noise of the dark faded, even for an instant, on the edge of eternity, Azura watches over the gates of the crossing behind the lunar lapis. It is a t As I said before, we did. But despite the sword's power, yes, it is. Arum Kor was one of my greatest pupils. Strong. Very. Why do we not aid more Dromathra? Why fear Namira if we bear Azura's blade? Why do we fear at all? When the time came to select a new steward of the Moonlight Blade, Azura chose another to wield it. Soon after, yes. He whispered lies to his fellow adepts, convinced them that Azura treated us as, as I said before. We did. Yes, it is. A room called. Why do we not aid? When the time came to. You became a lich. The Dromathra approach, child. Will you dance to the song of the dark? Will you close your ears and fight? Well done. Come, the sword is just ahead. Behold, child, Shandori, guardian of the Moonlight Blade. Know that if you take the sword, you take an oath to destroy Arum Kol as well. Bazamiri. So, the fateful moment is upon us. It is, Shando. So, Mazamiri's champion arrives at last. The, the blade and I are one. Long ago, I turned away from the sands behind the stone. Patience! The blade has rested here for too long. My connection to Azura and the Lunar Lattice feels faint. We should seek out this... Yes, it does my heart good to see... Mazamiri swore to safeguard the blade, and it... Hmm. Speaking about oneself is... As you wish. In... Miss? Arunkal was my brother. An ancient gift from our uh. patron. It exists here on Nyoni. But not only here. I would... <gasps> Dark moons. Has the faith truly withered that much? Yes. Brave Shandori will guide you now, child. But do not fear. Don't. Oh, welcome back. A witch of Azura. You bring worthy allies to this battle, sword wielder. And you've made a new friend, I see. Excellent. I didn't gather up any ancient spirits like you, but I did make a vital discovery. In studying the phylactery you destroyed, I, I... The Moonlight Blade, eh? And I assume this spirit bound himself to the sword somehow. Azura's will resonates within that Moonlight Blade, but it's so faint, like a voice at the far end of a darkened hallway, or the other side of a stone door. That's it! This sword, Arum Karl's phylacteries, they're not... I told you before. A room Karl's phylactery felt different somehow. Cavernous. Now I see it wasn't a vessel. It was a gate to another realm. 
a realm of horror that he controlled. Hmm, something about the enchantment. It's purposeful. Its strength seems tied to your new friend's will to serve. Fighting the undead with a sword near to hand might be enough to restore it. We'll need it fully charged to defeat Arum Kal. The undead outside should provide the power you need. If you strike them down, I'm confident the sword and the spirit within will do the rest. You should share this with... Shandori, was it? I doubt he'll object. He seems more than ready to... The world you see is just a small fraction of all it is, my friend. Realms of oblivion, pocket dimensions, the ethereal plane, the orbis, is it? A good question. The moonlight... The Riddlethar cult would have them believe that Kenathi, the wind god, whisks their souls away to sands behind the stars. A sugary paradise. Oh, I have my doubts. The hidden moon adepts revere somewhere else in town. I can't be sure. Comfortable? No, of course not. But life is full of little concerns. And I really can't be sure. Okay. God damn it. So, Aram Karl's orbs lead to a shadow realm. Of... In that case, it will soon sing with moonlight. Azura gave us this weapon to drive bent spirit. Yes, Swordfielder. And may Azura bless us. The ancient texts tell us that when we pass on, we rejoin our mother Azura. She awaits us on the other. We should begin our hunt. The ancient texts tell us that when we pass on, the great well of Kashiti spirits, the eternal soul that binds one, we will destroy it utterly. A darkness like our. Every dark spirit strengthens the blade's connection to the crossing. The bridge between near me and what lies beyond.
nothing but hunger. One day they will repent of their sins. Not today, though. So we banish them back to the void. I want that dragon to show up. Speak to Shandori, would you? Azura's Gate. No door bearing Azura's likeness is locked to the wielder of the Moonlight Blade. Once we enter the temple, we must look for Arum Kal's orbs. To destroy them, we must first they will try to flee back into the orb. But I will dance across the breach and destroy them on the other side before they escape. Without the shade to protect them, the orbs will shut. The power of the Moonlight Blade should dissolve the wards and allow us to enter the temple. Slivers of Aram Kal's soul. Fragments of the whole that exist only to defend Aram Kal and his phylacteries. We thought they were simple animated sh only loot. <laughs> it's like someone's just gonna put a plasma torch from top down. Sorry, my camera is falling down. Which of us? Where will we find the dark adept's orbs? His corrupt stench billows out of the northern vault, but darkness gathers to the east and west too. Then we strike east and west. Destroying those orbs should weaken Aramkal before our final attack. Please me. I can't risk the first thing I'll do what I can. Funny, the Colossus is actually more dangerous than the Bone Lord does some of it. It's really dead.
Eu acho sempre isso. Down one to go. Sweet world. Done. Is it orbs are destroyed? Well done. Destroying the orbs diminished Arunkal's power, but I don't know for how long. You have to strike now. Curious. Oh, so fast. Seconds. 
Just had to double check the gas is off because I thought I smelled gas. That's a wall cupboard. clouds my vision. I need to get closer. Don't wait for me. Destroy him. Azura be praised. My failure may not doom us after all. <sighs> he is. I know he is. But Moons forgive me. Good. Moons guide you, Swordfielder. Moons. Gone. Uh, is he a tall Khajiit or is he tall as a dark spirit? His realm. Now it collapses. No, I can find them. There, a portal. We haven't much time. Reach for me. Do not destroy. You may. Shano, he will not make it. Don't destroy. You have nothing to apologize for. I trained Shando to face the dark. He will find his way. I am sacrificed. You return victorious. What a relief. There may be one way, though it's not without risk. Arunkal's realm is one of absolute darkness. Your friend's soul is so thoroughly shattered. I can't be sure that what I'm gathering is actually Shandori. Of course I am. Stand in the ritual circle and raise the moonlight blade. I will do the rest. Light come forth. Cast off your shadows and heed my call. Shandori is whole. Azura shows me mercy. Shando, is that you? Yes, brother. 
It's time to go home. It's so dark. I can't. Come. I will show you the way. Oh, I get to help his friend anyway. Arunkar wasn't beyond redemption after all. That's heartening. If a, I think I'll stay here a while. The adepts of the Hidden Moon still have a great deal to teach us, it seems. As for you, we may have sundered and redeemed. It appears so, with our help, of course. My conjuring ritual drew every speck of light from Arunkar's realm of darkness. It appears that beneath all that evil, some kernel of Arunkar's on to the next life, I see. Cool. Next quest, I got. I only got one more of the um. Which is whipping scar, which is there. But I got two side quests first. I want to check out her crest as well. This is a thief for now down the mate. The one um from the one of the It's the start of the Evan Heart Pact. Where from? There must be a book. Yeah. I've just realized that's not an animal, that's a person. <laughs> that's a Khajiit. The aqueduct brings us water for drinking, washing, and bathing. Bazdal. The dude is huge. Hey, they're good looking. Hold on. The Khajiit might be mild. <laughs> oh, really? I can't talk to him while I'm sitting down? Hey, they're good looking. I hope Akon and Eljan didn't give you too much trouble. 
They're both wanted by the city guards, so I doubt we'll be seeing them in a reputable establishment. Job simple. I need you to search Rimmon's sewers for a barrel hidden near an altar to Clavicus Vile. Under the lid, you'll find a note that lays out to Haba's current whereabouts. She's the crime boss here and elsewhere. Kind of a big... You talk to her. Typically, I'd lay on the charm, personally, but... Tuheba and I aren't on great terms at the moment. I need you to smooth things over. Nothing so romantic. Think of it as a down payment on some valuable information. See, Tuheba hired Fez and I to steal a gem called the Jewel of Bondar for her. Fez stashed it away, but didn't tell me where. We get Fez, we get the gem. Simple. Jumped. I jumped out. But sure, bit of a tale there. Akon and Eljan, those two... Ch right. I tried to tell them they were wasting their time, but you know how thugs are. Anyway, the gangly one, Eljan, is moon-touched. Nice way of saying he's a half-mad sugar fiend. I had some moon sugar in my pocket, as you do, and he f He went berserk. Little rascal started climbing the walls. And I mean literally climbing, like a cat up a tree. While Akon was busy prying Eljan off the ceiling, I slipped my bonds and went out the window. Easy as sneaking past a moth priest. And in a sewer, no less, right? Fair question. I know a Khajiit, Naruz. We spent some time together. Very brief, but very... Naruz is a little anxious. Always thinks someone's watching him, you know? Trust me, friend. My talents will do us much more good here. Tuheba's gonna want a fair amount of coin for Fezkar's release, especially now that I slipped. Not steal. Gamble. Well, all right, sometimes... It's an opal the size of a fist. Never seen anything like it. Unfortunately, it's got some religious significance. That always complicates things. The jewel is a tribute to Bondar, the trickster. Actually, she hired us to steal it back. Mm -hmm. The Iraxian snatched it up when that Tharn woman took over Rimmon. So, really, we were just helping the downtrodden the thieves and footpads of elsewhere. Heroic, right? Once we found out how valuable it was, Fez demanded twice the price that Tuheba had promised us. Bad idea, but Fez doesn't really do sap. Bam, bam, bam. Looking for an easy. Stop and go market. I mean, not the market, the um, crafter square. Ten hours, ten hours, ten hours, ten hours. Ah, oh. we should have done one of these.
Well, I'm here. I might as well. Warm day. Oh, pack motion. Let's go this guy. Families. Oh, I forgot to visit the jewelry shop. No, I don't want to try any of them with him. Back in a second. Sorry about that, family call. <sighs> Here we go. Bank.
know these are probably worth something, but I don't need them. That's actually... Fuck is that? See what that's a deposit of all crack now. This way, yeah, I'm crafting around. Yep.
Yeah, that's gonna be enough for now. outside. It's going to be skeletons, bandits, just rats. Oh, Roxanne soldiers. Didn't think they'd still be here. Thought they'd be gone by now. Oh wait. Oh, it's a statue. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Where is that person standing? So, wait, look at the dog. Oh, it's a statue.
I'm sure he's upstairs, but the exit was downstairs. Ooh, so close. <laughs> Better luck next time, friend. Sounds like he's gambling. A lot of gold. Hey, you're back. I was just wrapping up my business with these fine Khajiit. Did you find the note? Huh. Makes sense. We hit the Euraxian treasure caravan just outside Riverhold. She'd want to be as far away from there as possible. Good. Darkpool Mind is in southwestern elsewhere. Tuheba favors the wilderness, so you may have to search a bit. What can I say? What I lack in charm, I make up for in luck. This gold should more than pay for Fez's release. I'm trusting you to deliver it. You could keep it, sure, but this is pocket change compared to what we'll make on the jewel. Once I settle my accounts with these folks, I'll make my way to the mine. Don't worry about finding me. I'll find you. As for Tuheba... All right, cats and kittens. Like my Uncle Edmund always says, best walk while you're ahead. You have yourselves a great night, huh? Hey, not so soon, pigskin. You have yet to play thy beat. Look, it's been a real pleasure playing with you, but I got a friend waiting on me. How about we pick things up tomorrow, huh? Devil or nothing? Well, you will at least let Ibiza and Cherjog walk you home, yes? The streets of Rimen are no place for a lone Beretta with heavy You're gonna rob him. That's a generous offer, and I'm truly flattered. But you really don't need to worry. I'm spry as a cricket. Pockets light, pockets heavy, whatever. Enough. Sit. Now. Do not take us for fools, Jakar. There a problem here? Don't worry, good looking. I've got this handled. Hey, if you say so. The day just started. I'm quite happy with the way the camera's sitting, but I'll we'll just have to do. You cheating shaveskin! Get him! Get him! Uh, scour the city! Find that swaggering mustache! You! I saw you speaking with that shit. Naturally, Jakarn's bosom friend does not see where Jakarn goes. Besides the cards that fluttered from his pocket as he ran out the door, you mean? <laughs> Dibiza knows it. What he was cheating, was he? So I'd be surprised if he wasn't cheating. He was cheating. I didn't want to surprise me for once. God damn it, the plants that I keep thinking of bamboo are moon sugar cane. Duh. What did they fall in this? Ah. 
odd. Oh, it should have taken the waste time. Chief, that's the one from Rimen, the one that deals with Jakan. Is what Akan says true? Do you find common cause with the Breton Jakan? Ha! A ransom, is it? And why would anyone pay gold for that foolish backstabber? Ha, ah, let me guess. Jakarn believes Fetzkar. Ha ha ha, you are direct. Good. I will be direct also. Give me this ransom of yours. If it is a fragrant sum, I will tell you where to find Fezgar. Fezgar would not give up the gem, so we sold them to a slave trader. The slaver died, but his ledger should contain the name of Fezgar's new owner. Look for it in... I would be careful in Dark Pool Mine. No, we could not. This troubles me because I take great pride in my creativity. A small-time cut purse withstands hours of aggressive interrogation, then suffers enslavement to protect his pride. I did not, but I do now. This will not stop me from cl Mind your tone. Akkad loves cutting out self-righteous tongues. You are an outsider, so I... There you are, spoken like a true child of Bob. From what Akan tells me, Jakarn did not know Fezkar betrayed us. Hey, we got a delve mission. Delve quest, I should say. I won. Headed into Dark Pool Mine. Good. For me. My partner Hadass and I came here to I survey the mine. To Hadass Plenty before. Of sulfur and oil hereabouts, right? Only catch the cave. Still inside! A dead. Thanks for the help, engineers. Like I said, boy. Yeah. Maradon is definitely. Why were I talking about this before? Right. Oh, cute. They're for they work. They're worshippers of Mayrun Stagon, I think.
Hmm. Yep, my ring is dead on. stuck on the wall. I have an oblivion portal. Curious.
path. This is gonna be one of the bosses. Okay, that's closer to what I was expecting, but... Just couldn't be wrong for once, could I? You're gonna be way too small for me.
you're almost dealt with. Oh, okay. Did I already close? Oh, I didn't close that one. There you are. Things seemed quieter, so Maradani came to look around. Did you find Hadas? And how about these cultists? I hope you gave them a swift... Stupid Hadas. Always thought he'd die from something silly like falling down a privy. I'll let his family know. And this hammer... Kra! How did you hold this hammer so long? Like hot coal on the paws, right? Maradani just can drop it in a bucket of water and forget about it, can she? Mm. I guess not. Ha! Me? No. The day of travel here. Yeah. I did. No, I saw the other one was here. You return? Like this. So it is encoded. What do you want me to Can you believe the tongue on this one, Bihargo? Oh, you have not been introduced yet. Bihargo is my sench brother. He eats people for me. Ha! So serious. Hmm. It seems Fesgar is as poor a miner as he is a thief. They sold him to another batch of slavers. Well, that looked promising. Any conversation with a crime boss you can walk away from, right? So, where's Fez? Did she cut him loose? And she took the gold anyway? For one measly piece of information? <laughs> Classic to Haba. So the tangle, huh? I know. For strapping heroes like us? Of course not. If these outlaws are... That's fair. What do you want to know? Can't I want to free him and want the jewel? Look. 
both. Great thieves think alike. He slipped past me. Why? That's the plan. Those bandits... So, are we headed into the... That's a griffin. <laughs> Looks like, please don't be a dragon, please don't be a dragon, please don't be a dragon. Just keep flying, just keep flying, just keep flying, flying. Oh. That could have got a little bit buzzier. Elf. Any questions before we leap into this slippery hedge maze? Another Zelf. Blessing be a would you like to hear the fragrance? Ah, yes. Mazdur entered this den of vagrants with the most honorable of intentions. That would be most appreciated. This one is sure you'll find the key near... Asura, bless you. Mazdur must travel many places to spread... It is true that Mazdur is trapped within this cage, soon to be sold off to... This one's tight. Wait. This is creative. No, stay back. Don't do what's the matter. The giant spike trap under Fesgar's feet. It could impale Fez at any moment. Not by choice. The ruddy fang trappers forced Fez onto this plate. They play this game with new slaves, 
To break their spirit, uh -huh. we teach them to listen. If Fezgar, you and Jakarn come to free Fezgar, bright moons, yes, free me. But to disarm their plate, you pull them. I'll keep watch here in case any guards wander by. You see if you can find the keys talking about. Deal? Deal. No wonder this place is called the Tangle. Above. Ah, here we go. Can I have those?
Nice. It looked like it was going to shoot downwards. Cage then. Praise Asura for your timely intervention, Rook. Come now, let us speak outside. See, Fez, there's our friend, right on time. There you are. Bandar be praised. Slide the key into the lock, tell you, so you can leave me here to die? Your new friend Fezgar was not born yesterday, Walker. I will tell you. Only that the jewel is hidden safe in a lockbox on a high cliff. You will not find it. Steady hands, friend. I'll just be ready. Right Free at last. Thank you both. Now, all this key finding and practice arming is hard work, yes? You've earned a rest out of it. Two faced little. Should have seen that coming, Jakarn. Sneaky little bastard. <laughs> Where did he even hide that gas bomb? Ooh, you know what? Let's not think about that. Friend. Right. I hate to admit it, but good old Fez is sliding rapidly toward dopey rival. Sometimes colleague at best. Ugh, anyway, Fez grew up in the stitches. Cliffside settlement above the scar. Mm. Might have hidden the gem. That exactly. It fits. Still, the Stitches is a big place, and he's got a head start. Fortunately for us, Akon and these bandits did a number on his legs. He hobbled out of here like an 80-year-old stork. We should split up. Famous last words, right? Whoever finds that sneaky Khajiit first holds him down until the other arrives. Then we all find the gem together. See you there, good looking. Wish you'd stop flirting with me. Not interested, mate. Although he might not be serious for longer. Could just be fucking with me. Master is great. Then you have. As of late, this one's thoughts turn to green shade. No, Master. Hey. Oh, I'm going to go downstairs and get some chocolate. Dragon be near the moon gate. Do you have any idea? 
This one would love to have the answer to many questions, and the answer to this question in particular eludes him. This one also does not understand the meaning behind the eclipse. One of my other friends claims that this dragon tried to absorb power from the moon. Dispo, I don't like the sound of that. Surely this isn't possible. Ah, fear not. That is in the past. Listen to me, Fez. That jewel's made you crazy. No one can make that jump. You lie! Panda smiles on me, Jakarn. Riches, glory, all will belong to Fezkar! Fez, damn it, don't do this! Stop! Fez! God damn it, Fez, you idiot. Why did... Wait. It's not that far. Oh, yeah. You see it? The Jewel of Bondar is right there on that cliff. Sure, but he was injured. And not half as athletic as me. Akon worked him over. You don't know anything. Larissa would want this. She'd tell me to... She'd tell me I'm an idiot. I really need a drink. You need a drink, right? I need a drink. Meet me at the Goiter's Gulp, would you? Probably so parasail down. Don't worry, I'm not gonna jump. I just need to clear my head and say goodbye to a friend. Fez, you stupid, stupid cat. I'm gonna miss your mangy hide. Well, look at this, Akon. It's just who we were waiting for. So, we meet again, Walker. I see you, but not your friends. Where truly? Dark moons, eh? Fez was stubborn and foolish, but he did not deserve... I warned you before. There is a hex on the jewel. I do not usually place much stock in folktales. With greed, yes. Perhaps I made a mistake in sending young Fesgar to recover it. Perhaps I... Let's find out, shall we? Hello, Jakar. Well, this is... No tricks this time. One way or the other, I need to settle things with Tuheba. Otherwise, I'll never have any peace. So, here we are, Tuheba. Ready to clear the air, or should I start throwing stuff? Peace, Jakar. All I want is the gem. Now, I will ask you one last time. What? You thought this one could not talk? I'll toss it in a vault or something. You have my word. Look at us, making nice. This calls for a toast. Suggestions? Mm. To bold foolish. Hey, I know you. At least I think I know you. 
My memory is a little hazy on anything past the last. <laughs> no, I'm not. Yeah. Taznazi made me swear to lay off the drink for a while. It's awful. Well, maybe not as awful as I thought. It means I've got a headache, but I don't know. I was in a bad way before you doused me with that bucket, and I really botched things at the keep. Taz. Yeah, well, we'll see. That's a ban. I kind of know that I'm close to having a enough uh, enough stuff to make money, and it's like I'm desperate. I'm not that desperate. Almost have the followers, I just need the viewers. Like, Twitch thinks I've got 49 followers, but it's 50. I just need one more, and then I need the three average viewers, but yeah. So, realistically, I need at least uh, probably 100 followers, and hopefully, I'll get three average viewers through that. Anyway, um, okay, let's go to you next. I don't know how the fuck I managed that. I must not have cared.
Following the ledger. What was this thing? An idol. Probably safely. So. Then the king of thieves was watching over you. Ah, oh, let's see, let's see. Ah, I bless you in the name of the sleek shop. Is Rajin a god? Of course, of course, sleek one. The king of thieves. Ha ha ha! You jest. Okay. Scar. Well, I want to reach Agrest too. Oh, it's a dungeon.
Trust me, he said. Believe in our Lord of Infection and Pestilence, he said. Hmm. That was like, come on, fuck him over. The bridge and I'll go left and hopefully not run into the dragon. Okay, so we're going away. Okay, let's fix them back. Oh shit. Someone's fighting it. Get back, Rakata. I won't let you have this one. Sheath your claws, Walker. This one does not want a fight. But you've walked into it. I am an exile of the Tenar Zalvit vampire clan. This wasteland has long been our home. Unforgiving, but we survive. My blood brother, Rakasha, tempts my clan to give in to their thirst. He urges them to abandon our way of life and prey on the caravanners without restraint. Yushiha is... He leads the Tenar Zalvit after our clan. Yushiha. Before the flu, that was very long ago. The world outside, a cabal of necromancers raided our home. The burial site our clan watched over for centuries. <laughs> she defied their leader. Our clan served as the caretakers of the Tanar Zalvit ossuary. When there was anyone left to seek burial. Kaji, our troubles began with the Nahatan flu. It swept through Orcrest like a flood leaving death in its wake. The tide of dead rolled in. Our clan grew from a small handful to a settlement in itself. In an instant, we lost our main source of food and gained many more mouths to feed. So, a tiger walks among the cattle. You were with Yushiha, yes? Did my blood sister? My clan, Walker. And she has no place in it until she drinks. Everything. Our lives were spent hiding away in Tube. There are predators and there are prey. Our... Do not listen to his sweet talk. Your claws are dull as always, Yushiha. Remember what I said, Walker. Rakasha toys with us. He is drunk with power. Rakasha is not so foolish as to needlessly slaughter his prey. Our clan must be herding the caravanners into the Tenar Zalvit. You will, Walker. I lack the strength to fight them. The Tenar Zalvit. It has been the Tenar Zalvit's clan home for centuries. A humble place of rest for Khajiit to begin their journey to the sands behind the star. Paradise, Walker. I am sworn. Our troubles began with the Nahatan flu. Our clan grew from a... Rakaja is no fool. He is a clever cat, Walker. Okay.
I thought I'd call it a kennel. Keep it's kind of disgusting. Put that key to good use. I'm gonna put it. I'll catch up after I've led this one to safety. Maybe I'm um, cutting the head a little bit, which is probably a good thing. Is it bloody jumper? I warned you retribution would come to you if you hunted Kajita's prey. Step down, and our clan might yet be redeemed. It's you who let this hunger do our dead, Lucia, not me. Unlike our clan mother, I am prepared for our enemies. Hunt me if you dare. Rakata! Rakata! There's no going back for him. Neither Rakaja nor the Tanar Zalvit clan. With Rakaja buried in this tomb, killing him won't bring my clan back. 
but making an example of him may teach the Tenadas. I don't believe Rakasha will give you any other choice. It's a lot. We should get back to the caravan survivors. This way. There we go. Thought it was gonna disconnect for a second there. It all. all right. Um, give me a sec. I'm gonna go downstairs and get something. Just be back. In
Okay, I'm back. Let's try that again. I'll restart the Steam as well, just in case. Well, whatever you like, had it's just my end or it's just a blip. did what I could not, Walker. Rakasha is gone, and his misguided beliefs along with it. These caravanners will spread the word of my clan. Others will come to hunt them down. What's left of the Tanar Zalvit will either recall our clan mother's wisdom to flee and survive, or suffer Rakasha's fate. You've seen what remains of my clan. They carry my bloodline, but they are no longer... There is nothing... Soon, neither the dead nor I will have rest. Tell me what you know of this orc. Yushiha thanks you for ending a miserable life. She is glad he will trouble no one else. This Zumog may be gone, but as long as his necromancers disgrace Tenar Zalvit's death... It, it has been a long time since Yushiha walked among her living cousins. And you as well, Walker. Okay. Hey. Well, that means it is time for the next area. Yeah. It is. Southern Elsie. Dragon God's legacy is the correct It is good to see you again, warrior. I want to thank you once more for protecting our abbey the night that Manimarko attacked. The fire of my gratitude still burns bright. Ah, but I digress. I, I remember that. Your aid once more. Quite correct. A former student requires my assistance, but I cannot do what is necessary on my own. Fighting the dragons that plague elsewhere seems in tombs. I will search one. You, the other, using this Dragon Guard seal. The seal will activate three glyphs, which, in turn, will reveal the entrance to the tomb. Between the two of us, I pray we find the wisdom my student requires. 
Will you help me? Find the three glyphs in Tenzel Will. Let me mark their locations on your map, along with where I think the hidden tomb lies. I prepared notes as well. Feel free to take them with you. Expert? <laughs> Far from it. I started looking into the history to help my former student. The recent Dragon Guard were defenders of... When the last emperor of the Riemann dynasty was assassinated, the Dragon Guard were disbanded. Various emperors in the intervening years have formed their own versions to add legitimacy to their... It's an heirloom my former student provided. It contains a minor enchantment that reveals hidden glyphs. I am... We can discuss that later. Right now... Okay. Once you determine... I'll answer what I can. A series of glyphs. There are two tombs nearby. Historical documents would be good. There you go. The top left. Lights on our encourage, probably.
There we go. <laughs> Got him. Starting stone. Bolts. Ah, there you are. It appears you were as successful as I. Did your tomb contain anything of note? Interesting. I found a similar map, but to a different location. This might be exactly what my former student was hoping for. Will you come with- The damage was mostly superficial, though there is still much work to do to fully restore the Abbey. My most accomplished student will meet us there. I think it best if my student introduces himself, in his own way. Here, you should carry both maps and present them to him yourself. We can depart for the Abbey of Blades as soon as you're ready. Right, I just remembered the, what the other your blades is. Follow me, warrior. I find the view from this approach most inspiring. Behold. Now I can rightly remember her. Hands <laughs> with the dude who looks like Kratos. Many blade masters earn their titles on these hallowed. My student waits inside. I think he'll be pleased to receive the maps you carry. Is that the bold good? Yep. Hello, hello. My old friend. The Sura sent word of your imminent arrival. Welcome back to the Abbey of Blades. It's good to see you again, Vestige. Ready to once again answer Tamriel's latest cry for help? I returned to the Abbey to help Kasura rebuild. I'm not much of a carpenter, but I do what I can. When the dragons invaded elsewhere, I knew my duty was the... Yes. Yes. The maps appear to be the right age. The sanctuaries they lead to may well contain the knowledge and relics I seek. We must visit these sites as soon as possible. Speak to Kasura. She and speak quickly. As far as I know, I'm the last of the Dragon Guard. Once my duty was to protect the Emperor and defend the Empire. Now, now I must carve a new path from the legends of old. Someone needs to take up the mantle. Besides, <laughs> faith and legends go hand in hand. They are the whetstone that sharpens my blade. Let us see where my faith in no legends takes Ah, our grand battle within the Daedric realm. I was ready to lay down my life to protect Tamriel from Molag Ball's dark. A noble goal, wouldn't you agree, Vest? Meet with me by the stables after you speak with Kasura. Hey. Okay. Warrior, did Sai Sahan find the maps as interesting as I expected? Ah, uh, yes, the grappling bow. A most useful device. Like someone combined a crossbow with a grappling hook. Nice! It's a grappling point and the chain retracts to drag you toward it. So we believe. The device requires incredible skill, however. So far, none of my students have mastered it. 
I expected you to rise to the challenge. You'll find the grappling bow. Well, I can certainly tell you what Sai has told me. When the Dragon Guard hunted dragons, they each crafted their own grappling bow. This one was found in the Dragon Guard's grave. Dragons fly. Dragon Guard do not. Instead, the Dragon Guard utilized the grappling bow to reach higher ground. I don't think any of us will have time to train to that level. Probably grapple onto the dragon. That might not be the most intelligent decision. Elsewhere, but Thalen Wood has a as luck would have it, Sai Sahan, an interesting choice of words. We tried to have sends labor. You look like you, you look like. Ready to train? Use the grappling bow to get up to the roof of the training hall and light the brazier you find there. That will demonstrate your start on the ledge of the building behind us. Merely. This old warrior has deciphered the first map. It leads to the Windscour Temple, hidden atop the ruins of Hoonding's Watch. I saw the light of the brazier. I take it you were excellent. As the saying goes, a weapon is only as reliable as the soldier who wields it. With that being said, it would be best to know anything we can use against the dragons. Tomes describing hunting techniques and strategies, weapons, Honestly, whatever appears to be useful. If you let's be on our way then. And that's his horse. I'll secure the horses while you go on ahead. things up a little bit. Didn't have to climb as much. Thank you. 
think. The Dragon Guard Sanctuary was hidden beneath Hoomding's watch all this time. It seems this sanctuary won't easily give up its secrets. Come, let us see. I'm gonna like the Brazius. It appears the sanctuary's archives are out of. I agree. After all, I am familiar with these personages. The stat. A brazier stands. We yeah. honor you, Grand Masters of old. May your flames burn eternal. Point has appeared on the platform above. What an archive! The Empire knew anything. The value of keeping good records. Have you found anything useful? Dragon hunting? The Horn of Jadari? This journal claims it's a dragon horn of great power. And the last of the original Dragon Guard went in search of it. Truly? That makes your experience invaluable to our efforts. Tell me, what does a dragon horn look like? How was it used? So the legends are true. Incredible. Dragon Horn would give us the edge we desperately need to combat the dragon invasion of elsewhere. After all, the dragon is far easier to fight on the ground than in the sky. Storm Talon Temple. That's the location revealed by the second map. It's near the entrance to Afrin's Hold in Stormhaven. We should head. Frickin' hate ghosts. Normally they're not as tough. These guys are really tough for some reason. There's those two there somewhere.
again, isn't it? There it goes. So this is Storm Talon Temple. Seems more like a maze than a sanctuary. It appears the sanctuary has fallen into ruin, blocking our path to the archives. As the Dragon Guards say, why did you try using your grappling bow? There may be a path forward that we just can't see from this vantage point. I suggest you take... He's on the way over there, or is he over here? If he's over here, how the fuck did he get over here? Hold on. Curse of the Black Base, that sounds familiar. Sounds like Alduin. Ah.
Were you able to find the Horn of Jadari? Interesting. We should prepare to face further challenges. Neither Windscour nor Stormtalon were easy to navigate. I suspect this next sanctuary will prove similarly difficult. We can take the horses to Windhelm and then search on foot from there. I don't see a way farther into the sanctuary. No, that doesn't seem helpful. You should try looking somewhere else. Claro, claro. That's dragon bone powder. The ancient dragon guard used it in their ceremony. Some young dragon skulls too. Of course, the powder reveals a hidden path. Follow it quickly. Another archive. No dragon horn in sight. Let's look around. Have you 
found something. find anything. Something about the dragon. By Leckie's blade. Of all the possibilities I imagined, that was never among them. No matter the dangers, we must retrieve that dragon horn. The fate of Elswin. Such a journey requires planning and preparation. Let's return to the Abbey of Blades and check... I'm going to leave it there for tonight. <sighs> I'll be back on on Thursday night, most likely. If not, um, not sure when. There's just a lot of shit going on right now. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, please like and subscribe. If you're watching on Twitch, please consider following. If you're watching on YouTube and not check out the Twitch stream live, link will be in the description below. You can check me, or you can check me out at uh, twitch.tv slash waitos96. Cool. Yes, that's it for tonight. But until next time, see you later. Bye.